Um, so last year I decided uh, it's probably time to um, have a look at what else is out there. Um, and I found uh, this application Zotero. Um, it's kind of the main competitor to Mendeley. Um, I had heard of it before, but what I hadn't realized is it's open source. Um, and I had, I had a look into it. It seemed quite active, so I figured, okay, this looks good. Uh, I went onto their website and I found that just when I was looking at this last year, they were just releasing a um, Mendeley import tool so that you can import all your data from Mendeley into Zotero. So I thought, okay, this is very cool. I can try this out um, and see what it's like with all my Mendeley data. Um, and this is where the story gets interesting. Um, so I, so Mendeley uses um, uh, an, a SQLite database to store its data locally. So I pointed Zotero at the, the database, the Mendeley database, tried to import, and I got a weird error. Uh, so I contacted the Zotero uh, team. Uh, they were very kind of uh, responsive. Um, I emailed them my log files, I sent them my log files and, and my data, and they came back and said, oh, Mendeley has actually started encrypting their SQLite database. Yeah. Uh, and um, the only reason they could think of why you'd want to do this is to stop another application extracting the data out of that database. Um, fortunately, there was a fairly easy workaround. Um, uh, Mendeley had uh, keeps backups of its SQLite databases uh, and the ones from the previous version that I'd used um, hadn't been encrypted, so I could just do the import from that. I lost a couple of days data, um, kind of no big deal. Um, so I managed to do the import successfully, uh, and I've been using Zotero since then. Um, and um, uh, it's got most of the features Mendeley has, um, and many other cool features that Mendeley doesn't have. So I'm pretty happy with it. Um, so what's the moral of the story? Um, every every good story needs a moral. Um, I, I think that the uh, moral here is that no matter how interoperable uh, an application claims to be, and, and Mendeley does make some claims around this. Um, you can never be sure if you've got control of your data if it's not open source. Um, or to put it uh, differently, if you want open data, you probably also need open source. Thank you. <laughs>